Hello guys, this is Jill speaking. Take a look at the ocean. These birds have gathered in their thousands and they're dive bombing into the sea because underneath and not seen from the surface is a huge school of bait fish. We dived on Jabeda when one of the, these was happening. And look at this. Thousands and thousands of fusiliers all gathering around, all chasing food. We couldn't see where the food was coming from. We couldn't see why there were so many of them, but they brought in the kingfish. And as the kingfish hunted, so they swirled round trying to get away from them, diving down into the bottom of the ship, diving into the hold there. And here come the kingfish, hunting. The whole shoal of fusiliers panicked. And this was the cause of it. You can't actually see through the denseness of this school of tiny juveniles that's just hatched. The reefs got covered in algae, and where there's algae, the eggs hatch. Even the ribbon eels are hunting. This is such a rare picture. We never ever see a ribbon eel swimming. And this ribbon eel is not only swimming, he's actually hunting. I couldn't believe it when I saw this. We very, very rarely see these animals out of the sea out of their holes and he's chasing after these little guys sorry it's not a very good video but oh my goodness it was astonishing to film this you, you, can't, you can't even see through the reef it's just full of fish and on the surface the birds hunt and underneath the Indian tube worm gently waves in the sea and beneath this brain coral even the marbled electric rays come out to hunt they're normally nocturnal this chap was swimming underneath all of them chasing this extraordinary hunting of hatching of new fish watch this I've never seen anything quite like this I was an idiot I went and filmed them going away from me instead of filming them coming towards me which would have been much more dramatic but I actually had to dodge out of the way because there were so many of these things and the blue banded snappers have come out in their thousands and they too are hunting this new little hatching of fish now one thing triggers another and the rays came out, followed by kingfish again. This ray is hunting across the reef. And this is not even one of the most prolific reefs, and these rays normally are nocturnal. This guy's hunting in broad daylight. And the yellow fish again. It's like diving in sunshine. It's so beautiful to dive in the seas like this. And there we have a whole group of rays hunting, also followed by kingfish. Kingfish are such opportunistic feeders. They'll go after anything. If anything's moving and looking as though it could provide them with food, there they are. And this chap's full now, he's had enough, he's going home. And the marbled electric ray is also full. He's eaten his fill. And he's also heading for home, back to his quiet cave. And look at the rays, fast asleep, full as a tick, and the Indian tube worm carries on waving 
in the currents, waiting for little bits of food to fall from the feast.